to another episode of Mrs. Phillips Camp Kindergarten. Today, I'm going to tell you a story about a special turtle and her adventurous day. And the title is Myrtle's Adventurous Day. Myrtle the turtle is a green sea turtle. She lives in the warm tropical waters off the coast of Hawaii. She loves adventures and often spends much of her time adventuring around the sea. There's Myrtle. One day, Myrtle was out searching for some food to eat. She found a lovely patch of seagrass to munch on, but another turtle was also there. Hello, my name is Heather and I am a leatherback sea turtle. Would you like to share my seagrass? Myrtle was excited to have met a new friend, but she wondered why this sea turtle looked different from her. Heather, I'm curious. Your shell and colors are different. That is true, Myrtle. I am very large and my shell is dark blue and gray in color. My shell is also made of skin, so it is softer than yours. Wow, thanks for sharing. I never knew a turtle could be, could have a softer shell, said Myrtle. to be on my way, Myrtle. I am headed for the Southern Ocean. It was great to meet you. Heather swam away, slowly disappearing into the blue water. Ooh, this is a colorful one. Myrtle was full and ready to swim to a new destination. She swam and swam until she arrived at a beautiful and colorful coral reef. She slowly looked around at all of the colorful fish and then she noticed another sea turtle. Myrtle used her flippers to swim over to the sea turtle. Hello. My name's Myrtle and I am a green sea turtle. What's your name? This sea turtle was peculiar indeed. He had a colorful shell and an interesting looking nose. Um, I'm Bill, the Hawksbill sea turtle, and I love spending my days here at the reef. There are very few of me left, so I'm kind of a big deal. I like to stay here because there are so many sponges for me to eat. Sponges? asked Myrtle. You eat sponges? Like the kind humans use to wash dishes? Ha ha ha! No, silly Myrtle. I eat sponges that are all over this reef, even hiding in small nooks and crannies, said Bill. How are you able to get those tiny ones hidden between the rocks? asked Myrtle. My pointy beak allows me to grab them even if they are in a very tight spot, said Bill. Well, said Myrtle, you are very special indeed. Thank you, replied Bill. Well, I have to be on my way, said Myrtle. It was wonderful meeting you, Bill, and I hope we will see each other again soon. Goodbye and enjoy the waves, Myrtle. Myrtle swam away, headed for home when she saw something floating off in the distance. She decided to take a closer look. As she began to swim closer, she realized that she had found another sea turtle. It's my lucky day, another sea turtle, said Myrtle. Uh, 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 hello? Myrtle the turtle, and I am a green sea turtle. Who might you be? 
My name is Loggerhead Louise, and I am a loggerhead sea turtle. I am on my way to Florida. What a lovely name, Loggerhead, said Myrtle. Yes, I have, well, some might say a, a large head and a very big, strong jaw. That's why I'm called a loggerhead, said Loggerhead Louise. I couldn't help but notice your shell. It's different from mine, said Myrtle. Yes, some say my shell is reddish brown and shaped like a heart, said Louise. That's very special. Uh, Louise, did you know you have a crab on your shell? Oh, yeah, that's Curtis. He likes to hang on my back to eat the tiny organisms off my shell called algae. Wow, well, I guess it's nice always having a friend around said Myrtle. Well, I have to be on my way, said Loggerhead, Loggerhead Louise. Curtis and I have a very long journey ahead of us. It was great meeting you, Myrtle, and make sure to watch out for those fishing nets. Loggerhead Louise and Curtis quickly jetted out of sight. Myrtle was getting a bit tired and was eager to return to her beach to relax in the sun on the warm sand. What an amazing day I have had, Myrtle thought to herself. Myrtle began to doze off and as she did, she thought about all of the amazing types of sea turtles she was fortunate enough to meet on her day's adventure. The end. Did you like that story about Myrtle the turtle? I hope you enjoyed the story today. Tomorrow we'll check in and learn even more about the different kinds of sea turtles. Bye!